So hey everybody, it's Erin Reed at Creativation 2020, and we're gonna do a little walking tour real fast of the American Crafts hallway. This is pretty awesome. Now this is towards the end of the showroom, or the end of the show, so it's gonna be maybe a little bit tearing up, I hear some funny stuff, but you know what, let's get showing, and let me start off with simple stories. All right, so super cute papers. I absolutely love this. I just love the whole papers that are going on here. Adorable, adorable. I'm just going to kind of do a walking tour. I'm not going to look at every little thing because you can always go onto the websites, but it kind of gives you just kind of a quick overview of what the new stuff is for this year. So it's just kind of a simple walking. Obviously, they have their snap folders over there. Super cute. Look at this. Wander. Shipping in June. Adorable. All right. EK Success next in line, and then we'll jump over to Basil. So, you know, they have their amazing tools. I absolutely love their tools. Here we have Joe B's Boutique, all the stickers, lots of cute stickers. We love the stickers, Sticko stickers, Joe B's stickers. Obviously, all the EK Success tools, they're over here. Jumping over into Basil. Cool thing about doing it to the end of the show is that there's hardly anybody in the booth, so you're not getting bumped and so forth. They made these last year and I just thought that they were the coolest things ever. I'm so glad that they didn't get rid of these amazing artworks that are up here. Because I saw them and I think they're just so cool. You will keep them, right? Good. There's a lady over here and she's like, yes, we're keeping them. <laughs> I mean, I just love the colors. I mean, you can't go wrong with Basil Karstak. 200 hours to do that? That is amazing. Per or overall? Overall. Overall. Wow. Well, they are fabulous. Absolutely fabulous. Super gorgeous. All right, so moving along to so American Crafts. So here is the American Crafts brands. If you're ever curious about who is part of American Crafts, let's just do a quick rundown. We got Heidi Swap, we got Pebbles, Jen Hadfield, We Are Memory Keepers, Sweet Sugar Bell, Amy Tangerine, Coordinations, Paper Fashionista, Crate Paper, AC Food Crafting, KC and Company, Die Cuts with a View, Damask Love, Basil, Maggie Holmes, Sticko, Sweet Tooth Fairy, EK Tools, The Nook Hook, Vicky Bouton, One Canoe Two, Color Poor, Bo Bunny, Pink Paisley, Shamil, Jolie's Boutique, Dear Lizzie, Project Life by Becky Higgins. And there's one more down in the corner, which is Kelly Crates. I think, oh, there's one hiding back there and I can't tell. So let's go down, we'll kind of go back and forth. Paige Evans, that was the one that I was missing. All right, so here we have a Bow Bunny, super cute stuff from Bow Bunny. Let's take a look a little closer. Just, oh, you're fine, you're fine. Thank you so much, it's super cute. Bow Bunny makes the cutest stuff, adorable. All right, so moving over, Double Dot Designs. You know that Bow Bunny has those amazing Double Dot papers. They are so stinking adorable. Lots of, ooh, this is a cool one. It's kind of like a distressy one, very cool. Here we go, Stamps Essentials from Bow Bunny. Very cool. Moving along, we have Shamil. Shamil's, is she already gone? Shamil left. Ah, see, that's what I get for coming at the end, but that's okay. Now I don't have everybody in my way as I'm kind of doing a walking tour. Makes life easier. So Shamil, never grow up, super cute thing. She usually has like some sort of like, this is it. She always has had like the fun, like you can hold this up and have a blast. It is really cool. So here is Shamil's stuff. All purpose dye inks, metallic inks, color box, vinyls. Ooh, these are cool. What are these? Pigment inks? So we have pigment and dye inks. These are made so that you can mix and create your own colors. Oh, that's cool. So if you get a stamp pad to put them in, like a, an empty. So oh. this is an empty stamp pad. It's removable. So if it dries out, you can throw it away and put a new one in. That's ingenious. And then we've also made it so that everyone can make their own pens. That is super oh, smart. That's a white one. That's a white one. You're not going to be able to see that. Oh, cool. That's so so smart. we have about 15 different nib types as well that you can choose from. So it really is kind of like a DIY and create your own color and mm -hmm. have fun. There's also different tops that you can put onto the bottles. They fit oh. right on. So you can do a spray top, a dauber top, a needle top. And then we have the art brush pens that you can fill with the ink and do more of a watercolor painterly effect. That is the coolest thing ever. Yeah. That is genius. And so they're, what are they called? Elso. Elso Ink Shop. Elso Ink Shop. From American Crafts. American Crafts. Well, that's what all this whole thing is. Yep. So awesome. Thank you so You're much. Welcome. I love that little spiel that you just gave. It was perfect. All right, here we got Pink Paisley. Again, adorable line. Lots of super cute stuff. Let's kind of walk in and take a look. Quickie sneak peek. Super, super adorable. 
Some things are already kind of gone, but yeah, take a look at all this. Love it. This one, okay, so this one's called Fifth of Monaco. Pieces are already kind of gone. And then here we have Paige Evans Bloom Street. Happy Scrappy Place. And then over here we have and many more. Adorable. Love it. Here we have crepe paper. Anything fun and new with crepe paper? See the two new crepe paper collections. Magical Forest uh -huh. and Fresh, Fresh bouquet. bouquet. Cute. And then this is my new um, planner collection. And heads up. Say hi to Maggie Holmes. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> so six planner designs, a whole bunch of accessories. Very cool. Stickers, washi tape. Very All cool. Fun stuff. Gotta have the flowers in the corner. Yeah. I love it. <laughs> Sweet story. sweet story, so nice cute. Very, oh, that is very fun. sweet. Yep. So like, so fun, yep. magic, hello, let's go. Thank you. All right, Hi, so. Hi, it's Vicki Booten in the American Crafts booth with my new collection, Let's Wander. Lots of fun travel stuff, great fresh color palette, all your embellishments that you need, and then of course, our mixed media magic. So the glaze in the prism color is new and the texture paste are new. If you're nervous to try that stuff, you have a whole pre-made pad oh, that's nice. with all the magic included. That is cool. So lots of fun. New stencils, stamps. Cool beans. Lots of um, fun. Very, very cool. Awesome. Thank you so much. All right, so here we have one Can You Two super cute cards, all these little pre-made cards. It's absolutely adorable. Here we have paper fashion, super cute stuff over here. I'm just gonna do, here's Moxie. That's so, really cute stuff, love that. Amy Changerine, she's got her picnic park line. Look at this cute setup over here. Adorable, adorable, adorable setup. So Damask Love's got her own girl power line. It is so adorable, look at this, super cute. Slay, super girl, lots of pink. Super adorable. I absolutely love that. So this is all from Damask Love. So we got Project Life. We got the paper pads. Maybe all the different paper pads from all the different people. Shamil's in here, Vicky Vicky Booten. Um, here we got Sticky Thumb, Tools and Punches, Thickers. We all love our thickers. <laughs> Kelly Creates. This is my brush lettering line uh, that I came out with a couple of years ago and last year. And this year we have our new watercolor lettering line and you get workbooks and paper pads to learn from, a palette, watercolor inks that you use in the palette with the brushes. There's two kinds of brushes, water brushes, wooden brushes, and also water brushes pre-filled with black ink Ooh, that's nice. plus watercolor pencils. So using all of this you can learn watercolor lettering. It is one of those things I've always wanted to do, and like I've kind of dabbled in it, but I never feel like I'm good enough, and I just don't practice it enough is the bottom line. That's you gotta do the practicing. And I think I'm just like, eh, I'm too lazy. <laughs> but you are amazing. Your brush lettering is just, I mean, just take a look. This is the stuff that she does her brush lettering on. So Thanks. you can take her things, because these are all stamps, correct? Yeah, and you can so either you can fake it. <laughs> you can fake it, but you can also stamp with my um, stamps kit here. Um, you can stamp with light gray ink and then you can trace this with my small brush pens oh. And so you can trace and practice and stamp. Well, that's smart. Mm -hmm. Yeah So go from the pro right and then just start kind of following along and train your hand by going over the stamp Yes, that is smart. Yes. Thank you so Thank much. You. I appreciate it. Thanks So here we are in Heidi Swap. Unfortunately, I know she already left She said that she had to leave actually yesterday because this is day three so we're not able to be here today. So just to kind of, she cleaned up her booth. It looks awesome. Scrapbooker, journaler, planner. I mean, it's just an awesome, awesome looking booth. I love it. And she's just got all of her storylines, her chapters, papers. Just a really cool looking booth. I love this thing. They were painting this when I walked in the first day. It's awesome. Of course, she's got her mink and she's got all of her foils. And here, I mean, look, her brushes. And then she's got three different mink sizes, as you can see, going down the line. And then we have Art Walk. We got our papers here. And let's take a look at what this looks like on the front. So every day, very cool. And then she's got her great, look at this. Awesome, awesome, awesome Heidi Swap. Very cool. So now we are over doing the mold press. And so how does this thing work? 
All right, so we're gonna take a piece of plastic. It has a little protective coating on both sides, so I'm just gonna go ahead and quickly peel that off. All right, and we're gonna put this into our magnetic um, frame here and then put that into our mold press machine. It's gonna magnetize up to the top. And uh, this is a heating element right here, so it's actually going to heat and soften the plastic. Okay. And meanwhile, we can pick out what we wanna put in there. So we have a bin full of random items. People have been taking Lego blocks and putting their names on them, wood blocks, we have seashells, we have you know, all sorts of wood pieces. It's even gonna pick up like the fine detail. Oh, well, of... let's do that. Okay. Cool. Yeah, let's do that. All right, so let's go ahead and put that in there. So you really can take anything that's soft, hard. Yeah, all it's, sorts of yeah, things. Yeah, just really have fun with it. Yeah, Go absolutely. look around into anywhere. And you said something about a vacuum. Yes, yeah, so we have also hooked up our vacuum. So you can use your at-home vacuum. It's just gonna plug into the back of your machine. Okay. The machine does come with an adapter, so it's gonna fit most hoses on the market. All right, and you can see that the plastic itself is starting to soften. I'm not sure if your uh, camera is catching that, but it's kind of starting to droop. Oh yeah, a little form bit. A, a bubble there, and that's telling us that we're pretty much ready. So, so when you start seeing the plastic, it kind of like. Mm. Yeah, exactly. Okay. But all so there's no like magic is... boop timer or anything. <laughs> no, it's actually there's actually a measurement on here, so it's kind of it has to do with the height of the object and the droop of the plastic. And okay. And then we're just gonna go ahead and turn on our vacuum. She just pulled it down, and it suctioned itself in. That was fast. To, you just yeah. let it kind of cool down for a second. Like how hot is it when it comes out? It's not very hot. You can feel it. Oh yeah, not bad. And then you can see the amazing detail that we've captured in there. That's awesome. Yeah. So what are these little bubbly things off the side? Just because it came down and it was where it was, but it's the mold is there and that's yeah, what you yeah. wanted. Yeah. Exactly. That is cool. Yeah. And you can even see that it has the impression from kind of the. Yeah. The. Grid. The grid at the bottom. That's yeah. kind of cool. May I keep this? Sure. Awesome. Well, thank you so oh, much. Thanks. Awesome. All right. So let's keep on going down around. We are memory keepers. Because that is our new mold press they had. And so here they have the button press. You can make your own button. Pretty cute stuff. Coming in May, June. Make your own button button press. Coming soon. So I guess they had all the pieces in here where you can make your own button. You know, we are memory keepers always has albums. They have board punches, all the cool board punches. You know, just lots of really cool stuff. They have the cinch. So it just, it never really ends. There's always really cool stuff. All right, so here we have the nook hook. All kinds of, obviously, weaving and textiles. And then we have food crafting. You look like you need a buddy. What do you want to tell me? <laughs> what do I want to tell you? Yeah, what's Final? going on over here? Um, lots of stuff. We have a bunch of sprinkle mixes under Sweet Tooth Fairy and a bunch of candy on the candy wall. Make, just makes you cake, hungry. I know. Makes cake decorating and cookie decorating super easy. So fun. Tons of fun examples of all the fun treats you can make with our stuff. Do you just get hungry as you're standing in here in the booth? <laughs> I mean, seriously. I think I would always be like, I want a cookie. Yeah. So I want true. Some sprinkles. Because I'm staring at it all day. Yeah. <laughs> and you can't eat any of it because you don't want to eat like <laughs> that adorable looking cake and cupcakes. Let me get the spanner. In. Look at those adorable cake and cupcakes. It's not like you want it on cookies. It's been sitting there for what, five days now? Uh, four. <laughs> four. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'm sure it tasted wonderful, but it's probably fake underneath, is my guess, right? It's actually real. It is? Oh, those that's are real? Held up. Wow. It's still a little soft, surprisingly. That is, that is pretty cool. Okay, so still, I don't think I'd want to eat cake that's been sitting <laughs> no, there for four days. No, no. So we have lots of cute molds back there. So they're cookie cutters. Cookie cutters. Yep, cookie cutters. And, those are adorable. and I love tools. the colors of the cookie cutters. Yes, super fun. See, this is Your jars just, can be pretty too. Look how adorable this is. Yeah, like just baking the, chips. Those are cool. I know. Do you guys, this is. They will be coming out. Those soon. are coming out too. Mm -hmm. Colored baking chips, and are they like vanilla flavored? Are they yeah. actually okay? Yeah, absolutely here. Go oh, I can have. I score. Yeah. <laughs> Woohoo! I get to have some colored baking chips. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> From mama <my> mouth. <laughs> this is alive, by the way. Heads <laughs> up. Those are good. They are, yeah. Oh, well, you can see the picture over there. Yeah, super adorable. That's our unicorn mix. This is our Whatever rainbow mix. And unicorn, rainbow, rad. <laughs> that is rad. I love that. 
And then the candy melts. Yeah, candy melts. And then the little mini sprinkles. Yeah, mini so ones. it's, well, the, in all of them they have like oh, mini little and minis. big, so it's, yeah. Give them more of a texture. Those are actually really good. You figure they would taste kind of waxy or something, yeah. but they're not. No. No, they're really nice yummy. They're creamy, aren't they? They're really good. Thank you so much. Yeah, have a great day. All right, we are now in Pebbles. Pebbles, Pebbles, super cute stuff in Pebbles. Look adorable. And then, oh, look at the cutie, cutie sloth. Jen Hatfield homemade. Sorry, there's people talking behind me. What'd you get at a show? All right, so look at the Live life happy. Oh, look at the cutie cloud and the most adorable little unicorn ever. I want that with my daughter's room, that giant thing. <laughs> it's adorable, super cute. And let's look at the papers. No bad days. Of course, no bad days. There's never a bad day. Not as long as you make it that way. Lovely moments. Look at the lovely moments. Super adorable, super, like, very sweet, very gentle. And then this one's called Sun and the Fun. Or Sun and Fun. There it is. Sun and Fun. And lastly, to finish off, we're going to finish off with Die Cuts with a View. Amazing Die Cuts with a View. I love their stacks. They always have wonderful stacks, super cute stacks. I think I just, they're the most amazing you can get so many things one of my favorites i've used this one quite a lot the indigo craft and rose gold that one is awesome the old world stacks even stacks that i've had for like five or six years i still pull them out and use them and i still love them so truly they are timeless and the papers in there are wonderful they also over here we have these letter boards from that cuts the view so look at all the cool letter boards absolutely awesome so thanks so much for walking around with me in the American Crafts hallway and going through. We got some amazing people talking about their lines. It is awesome. It is at the end of the show, so I was like super excited that they were still there and like perky and happy to talk about their products and like what their new stuff is. So we got some, some amazing stuff. So here again is all the different products we went through and I showed you all the different lines and there's some behind my head. I know they're backwards, but I listed them earlier in the video. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell button and I'll see you guys again later. Bye everybody.